Hello again, back on the uh, lights project here. Um, I've cleaned up the wiring a lot. I took out all the extra links of wire um, where I knew I wasn't going to need it anymore and have tucked everything away. You can see here. So that makes things uh, quite a bit cleaner in there and less likely to, for something to come loose or less likely for me to get electrocuted. Um, I've been working on the wiring for the Arduino and I decided that uh, I wanted some kind of visual indication on the outside of the box that uh, that I was going to get that I was getting uh, the right control signals through the pins from the Arduino into the relay board. The relay board actually has LEDs next to each relay, which is nice, so you can see that they're getting activated. But since that'll be mounted inside of the enclosure, you know, you won't be able to won't be able to see it unless the lid's open. So what I've done is I've just built this little LED board here. Now I've got um, 16 different channels that I'll be able to control power-wise. I only put 15 LEDs on this board because that just happened to be how they, they fit well in a row that way. And that's alright, as long as I know that I'm getting something here. So that'll that'll cover all the channels but the first one. Um, so channels 2 through 16. Uh, the Arduino Mega 2560 has, um, oh, let's see, 15... Pin, digital pins that can be used for pulse width mod, modulation, which is what I'm going to attempt to be using to turn the relays on and off very fast in order to produce like a dim dimming effect on the lights. And those pins are 2 through 13, which are up here, and 44, 45, and 46. Now I've got 16 channels and I've only got 15 pulse width modulation pins. So that means one channel can only be on or off, which is all right. That's fine. I just always make it the same one, and, I can, and that way I can remember. Um, so this is the ribbon connector that's going to connect the Arduino to uh, to the relay board. And what I've done is I've, I've in line put the... Uh, the little LED board that I built here. And I don't know if you can see this very well, but basically, so this is the ribbon cable for the relay board and stacked underneath it, connected to the exact same set of pins, uh, is the LED uh, signal indication board. So when I turn it on, whenever the signals go, um, through the pins in order to control the relays, I will automatically get a, an equivalent output on this. And that's it for now.